In 2014, Indonesia and Turkey embarked on a collaborative effort to develop a new medium tank, prompted by a request from the Indonesian Army for an upgraded medium tank. The joint project involved the partnership of Indonesia's PT Pindad and Turkey's FNSS, initially referred to as the Modern Medium Weight Tank MMWT. However, the tank's names were later changed to Harimau, meaning Tiger, and Kaplan, also meaning Tiger, in Indonesia and Turkey respectively. This armored vehicle was designed to provide infantry support through its potent firepower and the ability to neutralize enemy armored vehicles. The tank concept was unveiled to the public in 2016, with the first prototype manufactured in Turkey and the second in Indonesia. The initial prototype was showcased in 2017. Subsequently, in 2019, Indonesia placed an order for a batch of 18 to 20 of these new tanks, while Bangladesh and the Philippines each ordered around 40 to 50 units. The production of these medium tanks was planned to be a joint effort between Indonesia and Turkey. The Harimau Haidam tank is equipped with a Cockerill 3105 two-man turret, produced by CMI Defense in Belgium. Its primary armament is a 105mm rifled high-pressure gun compatible with standard NATO 105mm tank ammunition, including armor piercing, high explosive, and smoke rounds. The gun's effective range reaches up to 4 km and features a rotary automatic loading system, holding 16 ready-to-use rounds. The tank also features a coaxial 7.62mm machine gun, with the option to mount an additional 7.62mm or 12.7mm machine gun on the roof. A notable feature of the Harimau Haidam is its capacity to launch Valoric 105 anti-tank guided missiles like regular munitions. These laser-guided missiles possess semi-automatic guidance and are equipped with tandem-shaped charge warheads. With a range of 5 km, they can penetrate armor up to 550 mm thick, even behind explosive reactive armor, enabling engagement of heavily armored vehicles at extended distances. The tank is equipped with a modern fire control system, incorporating thermal imaging sights and a laser rangefinder. Furthermore, the Harimau Haidam incorporates modern systems like a battlefield management system and 360 degrees vision cameras. In terms of protection, the tank features modular armor that can be augmented with additional armor for enhanced defense, adapting to operational demands. Its weight ranges between 32 to 35 tons, contingent on the armor configuration. Basic protection is against 14.5mm armor-piercing rounds, which increases to 25mm armor-piercing ammunition with add-on armor. The Harimau Haidam boasts underbelly mine protection, providing significant safeguarding against landmines and improvised explosive devices within its weight category. It can withstand explosions equivalent to 10kg of TNT anywhere under the hull. The tank incorporates an MBC protection system and an automatic fire extinguishing system. A laser warning system is present as well, activating smoke grenade launchers when the tank is illuminated by a laser beam, thus minimizing vulnerability to laser-guided anti-tank missiles. Operating with a crew of three, commander, gunner, and driver, the tank is propelled by an unspecified diesel engine generating around 650 horsepower. Positioned at the rear, the engine is coupled with a fully automatic transmission. An auxiliary power unit serves to power the turret and electrical systems, as well as charge batteries when the main engine is offline.